May I ask who you are here to see? I am Lindsay Porter from Sky Promotions. I am here to see Patsy. Yes, she is expecting you. Go to the far left office and I will send her in. Welcome to the Frightville Country Dance School, Lindsay. You and your helper may please sit down. Thank you, Patsy. I wanted to take some time to discuss our promotional package with you. Good, I have been anticipating this. I noticed that you have quite a few girls here. I would like to interview some of them and get a feel for the place in general, and interview the rest of the Dixie Bells if that is okay. Absolutely. Make yourself at home and do what you need to do. We would also like to get a grand tour if you are available. One of us will help you with that. Her name is Lacey. What is your concern, Doctor? Administrator, we have had an unusual number of burn incidents lately. All involve adolescent girls. Well, what do you want me to do? What do you think is going on? My ward nurses here will fill you in, and then I will wrap up. I personally have seen a number of girls with burns on their arms and legs. I believe that the girls are either setting themselves on fire, or allowing it to happen. I heard one of the girls talk incoherently about a fire demon. All of them have one curious burn, generally on the underside of their wrist. It is like it is planned. It looks to me like we have some kind of sick game going on. I want you to contact the police. I need more than this. If you keep having cases, let me know. Thank you. I am going on lunch. We will soon have new initiates to the club. The fire demon is growing stronger. Soon he will be invincible. All hail the fire demon. Isn't this dangerous? Don't be afraid of the fire. Embrace it. All glory to the fire demon. You can set my jacket on fire, just the arm. It's a demonstration.
Jane, you and Lisa need to be on your best behavior. Don't you go setting any of your classmates on fire, Jane. Don't transform and eat them, either. You will be eating conventional food when you are not able to go hunt. Lisa, I think you will like this school. These are normal human girls like you. Learning how to country dance is a priority for you. I hate that human food. It tastes bad. We will go out hunting Jane, sometime. I promise. Aren't we a little old to learn something like country dance? Not at all Lisa. Just because you have chosen to live entirely as a human, it does not reduce your intellect and abilities, which are far beyond theirs. You two will be starting at the school before too long. I expect you to be model students. Try not to outlearn your classmates too much. You will embarrass them. I have two classes this afternoon, then we can meet later maybe at the diner. Don't you want to practice your dancing? We have been practicing hard enough. Let's go out and have some fun. We have some visitors here, some promotional team. They want to have a performance. Can you girls get into your dresses? Okay Hope. Give us a little while.
For your final test, I will now burn your wrist, as we have all had done. Then you will be a fully functional member of the group. Then we will burn the infidel at the stake. Let it be done. I wish to join. Thanks for coming. I know you were expecting to come in later but we had an opening. Actually I am grateful. I think you will like my two daughters. They can handle any academic schedule you can put out. I am glad to hear it because we need students. Do your daughters have any experience in country dancing and music? No they don't, but both of them are fast learners. Now Lisa and Jane, introduce yourselves. My name is Lisa. I am very coordinated and dying to learn. I am Jane, and I am ready to get going on the agenda. Excellent. I will send in the secretary. They smell tasty. My mouth is watering. Don't even think about it, Jane. This school is off limits. Hello everyone, I have some paperwork. Actually I will set you up with laptops and have you fill out some information. I will have you move your chairs up to the tables. We live on a farm that our parents lease from the owners of this school. When our parents saw this school they were impressed and enrolled us here. 
I am looking forward to learning to dance here. It's pretty simple. You need to learn certain steps is all, then learn to move to the music. Hey Jane and Lisa would you be open to a quick demonstration? That's if Kitty is willing. We'll get in our dresses and get up on the stage and you can watch. That would be nice of you. Meet you down below in about 20 minutes. The time has come to move to the next step. You will move out into the population and burn young females such as yourselves. Yes master. Do you want us to get their permission first? You need no permission. Sneak up behind them and burn them. Master what do we do about mortal law enforcement? Do not concern yourselves with them. I will deal with the fools. All hail the fire demon. We hear. We obey.
So how do you two like it so far? The school I mean. I am liking this. You girls are the best. Thanks. Hey we are going to go do the town later on. Would you like to join us? We'd love to. Jane and I have a couple of things to do with settling in and then we can have. Meet us at the diner, maybe one. We'll have lunch. Lisa why did you say this? We could have gone with them. Take a look on the table. That thing. That was not there before. It looks like a spy camera. You are right. 
we will take it to the house. You girls are sharp. Most girls might have thought it was a pack of gum. I assure you it is nothing that we have done. It must be the promoters that we hired. We'll look into this. In the meantime, please keep this quiet. It might disturb the other girls. Okay we will. If Jane is willing we might even help you look for more of these things. I looked them up. Their promotional organization was just a front. They specialize in hidden camera surveillance, and sell the videos on the web. What can we do about it, Patsy? I am going to take legal action if I can. We found a number of these spy devices on the property. Thanks to those new girls we found out. Most might have thought it was just a pack of gum. There is something different about those two. They were spying on you? What were they doing? Miniature cameras were placed in the rooms and around the school. The Dixie Bells said it was a promotion team, only they were scammers. I found out that the leader lives with her younger sister. Her name is Lindsay Porter. Her assistant has not been found. Your mother and I are a little busy right now. Jane, get with Gramps. I know you have been wanting some fresh meat. Here is your chance. You can have either one. Which one? I will take the younger one so you can have a full meal. Ah! 
That's my good girl. I hope you enjoyed your meal. Are you sure this is the place the girl said to go? Yes I am. The description is exact. Look up ahead. My god, what is it? And there is a girl tied up. Hey you. Whatever you are. Get away from her. <laughs> Foolish mortals. Do you think you can frighten me? Open fire. Let him have it.
So I heard that you are new to the news business. That's true. I was a researcher's assistant when the lab shut down. The reporter that I am replacing was killed in a mid-air collision in a helicopter much like this one. I applied for the job after my lab closed and she was killed. So what exactly are we looking for? Some girls apparently had a game where they were setting each other on fire. I am going on a tip that their hideout is up here in the hills. Why would they set each other on fire? It was some kind of sick game. That's what the cops think. There is smoke up ahead, and two problems. There are two police SWAT helicopters warning us away, and a bad thunderstorm. The helicopters are 20 minutes away, the storm is only a few minutes. It looks like a forest fire. What is that? I don't know. We should stay away. The storm. We are being told to return. This is Sister Sara reporting on the top story of the day. Local teenage girls suffering serious burns apparently were suffering a form of hysteria. News 8 attempted to investigate their hideout in the hills, but unfortunately our helicopter was driven back by a forest fire. It was apparently sparked by lightning. Unfortunately, two police officers were apparently burned to death in the fire. Now for more on the girls being burned, we have a child psychologist. It appears that these girls started this as a game. It is a little unusual for teenagers to have an imaginary friend, but not unprecedented. What we are looking into is how this hysteria could have gotten out of control. How badly will they be scarred by all this? There will be bad physical and emotional scars from all this. They are young, and hopefully they will be able to outgrow this. Thank you for your time. In other news, 
the Dixie Bells will be playing out in town, and reportedly have two new girls who have been learning country dance. Get out and enjoy them if you can. They are a treat to be heard and seen. Hello I am Patsy McGuire. Before our dancers take the stage, I wanted to introduce our two newest dancers who are fast learners and new to the school. Jane has the brown hair, and Lisa Golden Brown. They show major potential. Now the others will take the stage, followed by the Dixie Bells.